Hey folks, welcome to the KEI Fabrication Channel. This is my shop. I'm not going to show you all of it right now because this is an introductory video. I just want to tell you a little bit about why I'm on YouTube. This is my first video. One thing you need to understand is that I've never edited video before. The camera I have is an old Fuji film, uh, about 10 years old, and um, it doesn't have image stabilization and it's going to be terrible video until we can do something a little better. My history is motorsports. I've been in this for 25 years, mostly part-time. I did earn a living out of this shop for a good seven years. And um, general repair, street rod, NASCAR, circle track, SCCA, Porsche racing stuff, mostly safety equipment, roll bars, chassis adjustments and modifications and tunings, putting rack and pinion steerings and street rods and things like that. Um, again, mostly safety equipment. Um, every piece of equipment in this shop was bought used. Nothing is new. Um, it either came from yard sales or scrap yards and was modified and converted to do the job that I wanted it to do. Um, the majority of the beginning of the channel is going to be about my LS swapped Mazda B2200. You'll see more about that very shortly after my introduction video is released. Um, I've been a do-it-yourselfer, worked by myself all, all my life, and I've uh, been a mechanic since I was about 14. Mostly self-taught. I started junking cars for a friend of mine when I was 14 and the disassembly uh, and putting cars together to resell was where I got most of my experience. So I hope you like the channel. I'm totally inspired by doing this from um, Boosted Boys, Cletus McFarlane, Faster Proms, DeBoss Garage, um, many others. All you folks have done a wonderful job and um, I see and uh, Kill Fab Fabrication, Kyle has been doing all these things with some pretty high-tech stuff and most of the stuff that he does I've been doing for a long time but all with old school stuff the hard way no sheet metal stuff I've done all fabrication with tubing um, both rectangular square and round I have two benders and um, over the years my shop has uh, gotten really cluttered um, got a lot going on in here we always do some projects and they usually are thrashing type projects where they need to get done quickly so the shop has suffered a little bit. Hopefully as part of the videos progress, you'll see the shop transform into a 25 year old mess into uh, little by little refurbishing some things, getting some paint on the walls, slowly getting LED lighting swapped over from the old fluorescent stuff. So it's a little dingy in here right now. Um, when I first moved into this garage, it was bare walls. It was. Uh, so there was just studs. There wasn't even any wiring. There was no insulation, no sheetrock and I had barn doors that swung out on it. Again, everything from this came from either uh, swap meet or yard sales. These metal doors I've had for 25 years. My friend and I installed them. We borrowed a forklift and put them up. They're, uh, they just keep the weather out. That's about it. Um, they're steel fire doors that came out of a factory. Um, so um, the whole shop was kind of done that way. On a budget, do it yourself. And again, the uh, acquiring of equipment was just one piece at a time and uh, making and modifying stuff to do what we wanted to do. So I'll show you the shop equipment um, a little later on. I'm a little embarrassed by the condition of my shop, but hopefully you'll see the transformation take place. So stick with us. Be patient with me. The video editing is going to be terrible in the beginning, and the camera that I have is horrible. But it's all I have, so um, it's enough to get started. So... Uh, Hopefully you'll be interested in this Mazda B2200 that's been LS swapped with a 5.3 truck engine. We'll go into detail on the, the history behind it and why we did it and what its intentional uses are. If you uh, want to hang out, like and subscribe. I'll try to post as many videos as I can. There'll probably be about one a week at this point.